Hello to everyone, this is Adventure Story and today I will have this nice test for you. I will test myself to see wh where I'm about in the operator, okay? First of all, I will enter Adventure Story Okay, here and let's go to test to see. Uh, this is the, the test about the operator. How uh, well I know the operator, okay? Let's see the first question. Hot water inlet and outlet valve should be open. Mm. When should be open inlet and outlet valve, okay? Uh, the correct answer here is uh, the A when there is a minimum 90% of vacuum. This is the correct answer. 30% vacuum is not correct. Okay, let's continue next. The injector pump supplies what supplies? Coolant in the form of seawater to the condenser, feed water for evaporator and water for the combined brine air injector. Uh, this is the correct answer. Okay, let's continue. Next. Okay, if you like to see the next uh, also answer. Water of combined brine and drink only. No. Let's continue. So number three. <coughs> Air valve installed on the upper part of the separation vessel. Should be open during vacuum creation procedure. No, should be closed. Should be open after stopping the plant. Should be remain closed at all time. No. Should be open after stopping the plant. This is the correct answer. Because why it should be open? So the evaporator will breathe inside. We do not like a vacuum created inside the system. Okay. There is much bigger pressure right. Let's go to the next question. Four. Having reached the boiling temperature, the feed water undergoes what undergoes? What happened with feed water? There is not total evaporation, that is true. This is partial evaporation. Some water is evaporated and other water drops fall down. This is for sure. Let's go for number five. The combined brine air injector is supplied by injector pump. This is the correct. Number six, the evaporation temperature 4050 corresponds to a vacuum of, I believe, uh, this evaporating temperature must be vacuum 90, 95%. Yes, this is correct. In order to obtain the specified flow of hot water it's necessary okay it's uh, in order to obtain the specified flow of hot water it's necessary to adjust bypass valve until desired jacket water temperature difference is reached this is the correct answer too low hot water flow yes adjusted by bypass valve will cause uh, high boiling temperature, no. Low boiling temperature, too low hot water flow, low boiling temperature, and drop of fresh water production. Yes, drop of fresh water production, this is the correct answer. Okay, let's go to number nine. The vapor generated in the evaporator passes through the mixer and condenser. This is the B, number two. Okay, and let's see number 10. The fresh water produced in the is delivered to a tank by, or sometimes it depends, built on fresh water pump or fresh separately pump. Built on fresh water pump. I believe this is the B. Sometimes it's separately also. Okay, let's answer B. Okay, and this is 10 questions. I will press end and I will see my results. Okay, my score is 100. Congratulations, I know. 
very good alpha Laval. This is my certification. Okay. I will press exit and I will finish. Okay, thank you for watching this tutorial. Watch more videos. You can see more videos uh, in the list of marine engineering. I have separate uh, location. Okay, where you can see some interesting marine engineering videos and more. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.